Hey survivors, in this video I am going to be telling you how to get revenge on the narcissist. Please like, comment, share and, su and subscribe. Click the bell icon to receive notifications for my future videos. If you would like to donate, my PayPal link is in the video description. If you are interested in one-on-one -on -one coaching, you can email me at narcsfeathercoaching at gmail.com. How to get revenge on the narcissist. If you want to get revenge on the narcissist, you need to identify their insecurities, weaknesses and vulnerabilities. You need to identify their uncertainties or what makes them lack confidence. You should then reframe the situation and find ways to provoke, manipulate and gaslight the narcissist. You should find whatever it is that they are insecure about and then provoke them. By provoking them you will then reveal their true colours. You will reveal who they really are, rather than what they portray themselves to be. It will cause a narcissistic injury and they will act out in ways that you haven't seen before. Be cautious as they may do things that are harmful or unfavorable to you. When a narcissist engages in acts of sabotage, competition or projection, it suggests that you have caused a narcissistic injury. By engaging in this form of revenge, you will definitely hurt them, but you will also be putting yourself at risk When the nar narcissist is triggered to self-reflect, they will often lash out or do something to hurt you. The difference with the narcissist is that there is no cut-off point for the amount of pain that they can inflict on someone. Once you have hurt them once, they will desire to take revenge from that one incident and it will just go on and on. No amount of your pain and suffering could ever be enough for the narcissist. Because no matter how much damage they have caused to you or your life, in their minds, theirs is always worse. No matter what they do to you, they will never be able to make you feel as miserable as they do. That's why when the narcissist experiences a narcissistic injury, there is no cut off point for the abuse. They never give up trying to make you feel the way that they do. They don't self reflect or look within so they never resolve the pain or suffering that they are experiencing. They spend their lives taking it out on other people, using them to boost their self-esteem and regulate their emotions. If you do decide to target the narcissist, insecurities, weaknesses or vulnerabilities, it will cause a narcissistic injury. You will get revenge on them. But be very cautious. You never know what they will do to you. If you prefer a safer option of getting revenge on the narcissist, you should identify what the narcissist needs from you.
The narcissist is dependent on your attention and your admiration of them. They need you to validate their existence and make them feel as though they are something of value or significance. If you want to get revenge on the narcissist, you can take away the attention and admiration that you would normally give to them. They may be dependent on your financial resources, material items or sex. If you want to get revenge on them, take those things away. You are essentially treating them like a child. But this is the only thing that narcissists respond to. They are self-absorbed and lack empathy. So all they really care about is their own needs. If you stop giving them what they need, you will be taking revenge on the narcissist. Another thing the narcissist needs is for you to be dependent on them. Your dependency on them makes them feel as though they are some, something of value or significance. It makes them feel as though they have something to give. Narcissists have to feel as though they have something to, to validate their existence. They have to feel as though they have something that you would want. Otherwise they would feel completely worthless and insignificant. They are dependent on your expectation of something from them. This makes them feel as though they are something of value or significance. If you want to get revenge on them, stop expecting anything from them. It takes their power away. It makes them feel powerless and as though they have no control over the situation. Stop relying on them to give anything to you or do something for you. Their self-esteem and their emotional state is dependent on your reliance on them. When you are relying on them or expecting something from them, you are giving your power away. You are giving them the ability to control you. The narcissist is dependent on these types of situations to function. They have to feel as though people are relying on them or expecting something from them to validate their existence and make them feel as though they are something of value or significance. When you take all of that away, and start depending on yourself. The narcissist feels invalidated as though you don't need anything from them. Withhold your time and attention from the narcissist. Stop relying on them. Stop expecting something from them. Stop depending on them. That is how you get revenge on the narcissist.
recognize that you were more of a benefit to them than they ever were to you. They needed you more than you needed them. And it should be no surprise that they needed you. You have so much to give. Give it to someone who will respect what you have to offer. Give it to someone who will appreciate it. Give it to yourself and use it to better yourself and improve your life. Start working on yourself. Exercise. Eat a clean, healthy diet. Do the things that you love to do. Focus on your own happiness rather than catering to the narcissist demands. If there is one thing the narcissist hates to see, it's your happiness. Especially when it is coming from something outside of them. When you are happy, enjoying your life and not even thinking about them, that is the ultimate revenge on the narcissist. The last thing they want to see is a source living their lives, out having a good time. They do everything they can to prevent that from happening. Whatever they are trying to prevent, do it. And that will be the ultimate revenge on the narcissist. Thank you for watching. I hope this video resonated with you. Please like, comment, share and subscribe. Click the bell icon to receive notifications for my future videos. If you would like to donate, my PayPal link is in the video description. Coaching inquiries, you can email me at narcsfivercoaching at gmail.com. We have a private Reddit community where survivors and thrivers can share their experiences and knowledge. If you are interested in being a part of this community, you can sign up for our Patreon page. The link is in the video description. Check out the Narc Survivor merchandise store where you can purchase your own Narc Survivor t-shirt or mug. We have a variety of designs and it is a great way to support the channel. The link to our Narc Survivor merchandise store is in the video description. Thank you for watching and I will talk to you soon.